As Offshore Europe comes to a close here on day one, three quick takeaways from my side. Subsea technology and sustainability, hydrogen and harmonics, and the third one, efficient power and process management for hydrogen. First one, it was Asmund in the session today on subsea technology was talking about that, you know, what they're talking, what they're talking about here is putting the electrical substations for offshore wind on the sea floor of subsea, not on top of a structure or floating. And he was just making the point that if you put something on the subsea, you use 30%, at least 30% less steel in building something that's above the waves. So when you start thinking about the sustainability implications and the price inflation with steel and, 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 these are the kind of things you now need to start thinking about, right? And subsea technology has been around a long time in the traditional oil and gas world. Second one, hydrogen and harmonics. It was Steiner in the hydrogen session this evening who was talking about, look, with an electrolyzer, you have a lot of rectifiers, a lot of power electronics. Power electronics cause harmonics. If you're grid connected, Harmonics is something you need to pay a lot of attention to because it has big implications for the grid codes. So again, stuff you need to think about. And the last one, again, in the hydrogen session, it was uh, Tor Christian was talking about, look, in traditional oil and gas, it was kind of like, look, we have processes and that's what we're really good at managing. The electricity and the power we need for that, yeah, that's just, you know, we just turn on a gas turbine and away we go. But if you're now off grid and you're looking at renewables and you're decarbonizing and you're sizing the batteries and whatever, if you don't have really efficient uh, power systems and power management, the, the business cases are gonna fly out the window, right? So uh, anyway, some fascinating things to think about. Anyway, that was day one, on to day two. Two more sessions with ABB tomorrow and then one on Thursday. So if you're here, see you at Offshore Europe.